Right, you can't see. Another year, another birthday. I'm one year older. I'm now 21. I meant to do this last year, but um, I had a friend over and things just got a bit hectic. So this, it was, well, it's my birthday haul from last year. So this is everything I got on my birthday. Um, so we'll start over here. I got given from my friend uh, two things. First thing is the new Star Wars Buildables figure. The Praetorian Guard, which I've now just snapped the shoulder off. I've got its joint is just so loose. But oh well. Yeah. I've decided to do quite like him. I'm actually planning on doing a spit off my phone. Cosplay on him. because uh, I do quite like this. I do understand this is the elite Praetorian Guard, so the one I think one of the eight that was in the film. I never I haven't seen last year yet, and I'm not going to either. Not for a while. Mainly because of all the fuss people are going. Uh, so, yep. So, over here. Here's the box. You can sit in the background. I also got given that. But, you're not getting the code for it. From my middle brother, I got the LMC Mark III and the M4, I think it's an A3 Sherman. M4 A3 or M4 A2, one of the two. I've got to, um, Wait until after I move so I can get my exacto knife to build it. From my dad. Many things. First things first. Uh, magnetic my, Mega Blocks Spartan 2. Uh, the, the, if you remember this series, uh, Mega Blocks did, I think, about two waves of different coloured Spartan armour and then a couple of Collector's Edition uh, that were magnetic. So. Uh, this is my third, second fully built one, but third figure. Um, I should show the top I've got. Right, I'm thanks to the box. I actually have two of this dark blue guy at the end here. This guy over here. And yeah, it's awesome. Uh, give it to my dad. My little brother gave me Halo Envoy. Uh, I'm actually halfway through it. I know I shouldn't be doing that, but my book is actually about Grey Team, so that's good. Quite liked uh, the cool protocol which Great Team was first in. From my dad, I got Microsoft Flight Simulator X Deluxe Edition. Shame. I actually do quite like flight sims. I play a lot of War Thunder and other games, although War Thunder is a bit of a question for. Uh, this game I have played on PlayStation 3 and I love it to bits. Blazing Angels 2 Secret Missions of the Second World War. Now, that is a vampire, if I do believe, of an early sense of a vampire being shot at by a Horton 229. And a couple of uh, jet powered Fockers, by the looks of it. J7M in Cairo, Egypt. I'm looking forward to playing that game. Crisis Warhead was another game my dad got me. Um, what was this? My mum's. I think it was my mum. I've yet to play this game. I played Crisis Two. I play. I've got Crisis Three. I've played through them both, and I found them quite boring, to be honest. It's just mainly how it is. Flight Combat, well, Combat Flight Simulator, done by Microsoft again. As uh, the other one, so Battle for Europe. So we've got German, American, and British. No French or any of the other ones. We've got a DVD called Fighters, which is DVD, and then it's got a P fifty one, which is an Ugh, boring. Another a DVD on the P fifty one. I find the P fifty one incredibly boring. It wasn't in World War Two. It wasn't one of. It wasn't the best fighter. Uh, in fact, if it wasn't for the British, the P fifty one B would have been the only one you would have gotten because the D variant had a Rolls Royce Merlin engine, I do believe, and that greatly performed it better. The Spitfire, the uh, one well, of the later versions of the Spitfire. Arguably the Thunderbolt, the Zeros, the Fucker Wolves, the 19, BF 109s, or even the friggin' jets that the Germans have were all so much more better. And they had one thing that the P 51 didn't fucking character. Uh, this is a British air show. Begin. So here yeah, you can. Oh, snap. You can see the Harvland, Canberra, some jets all performing. Now we're going to move on to something my mum got me. This is a bag full of the My Thomas Library, if you remember this. I love Thomas. 
I thought my thing. Ah, uh, so there you go. Oh, a whole bunch of these mini Thomas things. So we got Toby. So bring it in. Yeah, as you can see, he's really well painted and molded. Fortunately, you won't be able to see on my crappy phone camera. Got to Mavis. Henry. If I had Gordon, I would have the three original characters that started out. So, Henry, number three. And number two, Edward. Uh, the last ones I actually brought for myself, because uh, I got given 25 bucks from the landlord. Brought this mean-ass car, which I'm probably going to use for... Uh, design for a transformer. I'll leave a like. Leave a comment if you want a, a name. I've got an Ursul Gordon's carriage. Unfortunately, the pick up the front has snapped off. So, it's actually still rather good. Nick. Soda fuel. Another Ursul model. Diecast F sixteen. Uh, F fifteen. Jet. I think it's painted to look a bit like from Top Gun, but I don't care. And a Freedom. I'm actually going to give this a black paint and repaint it. It just, ugh. So that is my birthday haul. Um, the picture is up on Demiana if you want to see more of it. Um, yeah. So a bit of an update on my ch will be coming out. So be sure to hit like, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell. And be sure to join the notification squad. I'm Duncan, everything you want to be around. And good night.